It's your boy Doughboy TV back in this thing with another topic on the flow, man. If you want to become a part of Doughboy TV gang, the only thing you got to do is comment DBTV down in the comments, man. You're officially a part of the gang. You already know how we step in topics on the flow. TV gang, what's good, man? We back in this thing with another topic on the flow. And for today's video, we got none other but Tory Lanez and Young Blue in the building now. We got to get into it. Before we get in the video, y'all make sure y'all like the video. It does help YouTube with the algorithm basically getting my videos recommended. Now, Young Blue basically went to Twitter and, and all his social medias to basically, you know, holler at that man, Tory Lanez. Because if you didn't know, Young Blue been making hits, man. The man been blowing up. The man signed to Boosie. He got out his bad contract and got a wonderful one. And it looked like, man, he been on the Escalade up man just moving you know making hit after hit and one thing Tory Lanez did that he wasn't feeling was like he remade his song now when I say remade his song Tory Lanez you know he a rapper he come out with hits himself but he came and he basically heard one of Young Blue songs and it probably and probably felt some type of way about it where he was like man this thing is clapper so let me remake it now this is not you know new to anybody it's pretty you know regular for a lot of rappers to remix other rappers song but it's just you know i say this all the time you feel me if a person puts you on put you in a better position show you something do better in life or anything man you got to pay homage man you got to pay your respects man because at the end of the day if it wasn't for them you wouldn't be you feel me where you at right now and at this end of the day it's the same thing, man. Tory Lanez made a clapper. It went viral on, like, Instagram and stuff. And a lot of people was like, man, that's a nice song. You probably did better than Young Blue. And Young Blue didn't have a problem with that. He just was like, why you didn't tag me, you know, to put some respect on me? You feel me? Because at the end of the day, you wouldn't even have the mind or the song idea if it wasn't for me. And I respect that because at the end of the day, only thing this man is saying is, man, you only thing you have to do is tag me and I wouldn't be tripping. But now he's on a, some different time where he like, man... You don't want to tag me. You don't want to pay me homage. You don't want to pay me my respect. You feel me for being an artist? All right, put the song out and I'm going to get it took down. Because at the end of the day, it's something called copywriting, which everybody should know. And if you don't, you know, do your business right, you get copyrighted, get your video took down. And it's like kind of a huge loss for Tory Lanez because at the end of the day, this was a song that could have went platinum. You get what I'm saying? Because of the fans reaction to just him showing a snippet of it was great. So that no, you that just shows you that when you get it out there, the stream's going to go crazy and everything. But what y'all think about this? Because hopefully this don't create drama in between Young Blue and Tory Lanez where it's another beef because Tory Lanez already got a lot on his palate. He got a steel door dealing with his court case with Meg and all that type of stuff. He don't need to be beefing with other people in the industry. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about this whole situation. It's your boy Doughboy TV. If you rocking with me, you already know. Subscribe. If not, kick rocks.